Hello friends, welcome to CSS video tutorial series. We know that every HTML element occupies a rectangle box on the browser window. You can observe the corners are straight. What if you want to create HTML element having rounded corners? How do you create? To create HTML elements having rounded corners, we need to take help of CSS border radius properties. CSS border radius properties help us to independently configure the corners of the rectangle box. We can independently set the border radius at the top left corner. We can set independently top right corner. We can configure independently bottom right corner. We can set independently bottom left corner radius. Let's see the demonstration and get clear idea. I go to the notepad, you can see that I have default.html already open. It has the basic HTML document structure code written. Title is set to CSS properties demo. I have already opened default.html in the Chrome. Title is set to CSS properties demo. In the body section, I am going to create some div elements. I say here opening div, closing div. I am going to copy this div, paste few times. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Total 10 divs we have. In the head section, I say opening style tag type equal to text or CSS. Then I say here closing style tag. Within that, I say to the browser locate any div in this page. Apply width of 100 pixel, height of 20 pixel, background color of cyan and margin of 10 pixel. File, save, go to browser and refresh. You can see that 10 divs got displayed and all of them have steep corners. There are no rounded corners, right? I go to first div and say id of div1. I tell to the browser, locate any div in this page. If it has an id of div1, set the border top left radius. Border top left radius is used to specify the border top left radius of an HTML element. I copy that, go here, paste it and the value we can give in pixels, I say here 10 pixel semicolon. File, save, go to browser and refresh. You can see that the div1 has border top left radius. On the top left, you can find a curve visible, right? That is how you can apply border top left radius friends. Similarly, I go to div2, I say here id of div2 and then I tell to the browser locate any div which has an id of div2, apply this style. The style I am going to use is border top right radius. Border top right radius is used to specify the border top right radius for an HTML element that is rounded corner on the top right of a HTML element. I copy this, I go to notepad, paste here, colon, 10 pixels, semicolon. File, save, go to browser and refresh. You can see that top right corner is now having curved shape, right? That is how you can apply border top right radius. Similarly, I go to third div and I say here id of div3. I tell to the browser, locate any div in this page which has id of div3, apply these styles. That is going to be the next CSS property I am going to use. Border bottom right radius. Border bottom right radius is used to specify the bottom border right radius for an HTML element. I am going to paste here, I say 10 pixel semicolon. File, save, go to browser and refresh. You can see that on the bottom right, we find the corner is having the curve. That is how you can apply border bottom right radius to an HTML element. Next, I go to div4. I say here id of div4. Then I tell to the browser, locate any div in this page. If it has an id of div4, apply these styles. I take next CSS property that is border bottom left radius. Border bottom left radius property is used to set the bottom border left radius of an HTML element. I copy this, paste here, colon 
10 pixel semicolon file save go to browser and refresh you can see that at the bottom left corner we have the curve right that is how you can apply border bottom left radius let me go to div 5 i say here id equal to div 5 then i tell to the browser locate any div in this page which has an id of div 5 apply border top left radius of 10 pixel border top right radius of 10 pixel file save go to browser and refresh you can see that the fifth div has rounded corner on top left as well as top right that is how you can apply the curve to the corners of HTML element similarly I go to ID here I say div 6 and then I tell to the browser locate any div which has an ID of div 6 and apply border top left radius of 10 pixel similarly border top right radius of 10 pixel border bottom right radius of 10 pixel and border bottom left radius of 10 pixel file save go to browser and refresh now the sixth div has rounded corners on all four sides we can give different values maybe we can say here 20 pixel and here 20 pixel file save Go to browser and refresh this looks quite different now right here we have more 20 pixel 20 pixel here we have 10 10 pixel let me go back I say here ID of div 7 and I tell to the browser locate any div which has an ID of div 7 apply this style instead of using four CSS properties we can uh, use single CSS property that is border radius a shorthand property which is used to specify the border radius for an HTML element values to the border radius is going to be space separated list of values we can give four values we can give two values we can give single value also if we give single value that single value is dedicated for top left radius top right radius bottom right radius as well as bottom left radius let's see the demonstration here I say border dash radius simply I say here 10 px file save go to browser and observe this seventh div refresh all four sides are having now 10 pixel border radius set right similarly we can give two values if we give two values first value is dedicated to top left and bottom right radius second value is dedicated to top right and bottom left radius let me go to the notepad this time I give an ID here ID equal to div 8 I tell to the browser locate any div which has an ID of div 8 and apply the border radius of 10 pixel space 20 px file save go to browser and refresh you can see here the 8th div top left is 10 pixel bottom right is 10 pixel top right is 20 pixel bottom left is 20 pixel that is how you can use the border radius property similarly I am going to copy this paste down say here div 9 now I give 4 values 10 20 10 px 20 px and I give id here of div 9 control x control v should be here right file save now we are giving four values say refresh that is how it looks friends if you give four values the first value is dedicated to top left second value is dedicated to top right third value is dedicated to bottom right and fourth value is dedicated to bottom left radius I hope you guys have clearly understood how you can use CSS border radius properties to create HTML elements of different look. I suggest you people to experiment because we use most of the time CSS border radius properties to create more appealing navigation bars and uh, article sections or any paragraphs which uh, should be looking more appealing. For this tutorial this much is enough friends. For more benefits and be up to date 
प्लीज सब्सक्राइब टू माई YouTube चैनल डोंट फॉरगेट टू लाइक कमेंट एंड शेयर दिस वीडियोज विद अदर्स सो दैट एवरी वन विल गेट बेनिफिटेड कीप लर्निंग कीप कोडिंग कीप शेयरिंग थैंक यू गैस थैंक यू वेरी मच सी यू इन द नेक्स्ट ट्यूटोरियल